Do emergency services really work in GTA 4? Let's try calling 911 and see if the police, paramedics, and fire department will help us. First, let's start with the police. Of course, we need someone to attack us. So let's make someone our enemy. I'm skipping out on this fight. Take... Ah! Hey, Lockhead, you ready? Huh? Now we need to call 911 and reach the police immediately. Oops, we can't use the phone while getting punched. Let's quickly try to call again. I will eat you alive, Torag. Wow, as soon as we called 911, the man ran away. I wonder if it happens like this every time. Let's try it one more time. And once again, we've made an enemy. Let's see if this guy will run away when we call 911. Hello. As you can see, the man ran away in the same way. Every time someone tries to attack us, they run away when they realize we're calling the police. That's an interesting detail. Let's try this for the paramedics now. First, we need to reduce Nico's health. If we run in front of this car, Nico's health will decrease significantly. And now Nico's health has decreased a lot. It's time to call 911 again. This time we'll call for the paramedics. Hello, press two for paramedics. Hello, you're through to the MF paramedics. In which area is your medical emergency? East Island City. We'll send a basically trained paramedic as soon as we can, sir. Don't move and please have your insurance documentation or credit card ready. An ambulance arrived very quickly. As you can see in the top left corner, they will heal us for a fee. Here comes the paramedic. You be more careful from now on. Now Nico's health is full, and they charged us for it. Do you think it's worth calling 911 for this? You can express your opinions in the comments. Finally, let's call the fire department. We need to start a fire before making the call. However, when a fire breaks out somewhere, the fire is extinguished by itself until we call the fire department. That's why let's catch a car on fire. Now it's time to call the fire department. Hello, this is the FDLC. Where do you need assistance? Northwood. We'll get a fire truck out to you right away. Hold tight and please be advised that the FDLC takes no responsibility for damage to property. It seems like we need to sustain the fire a little longer. Here comes a fire truck. Let's see if they can extinguish the fire. Oh no, this shouldn't have happened like this. Looks like we'll need to try again. We called the fire department again. Let's see if they can help us this time. Another goddamn prank call. Another goddamn prank call? What is he talking about? There's a fire in front of him and he doesn't see it. Truly unbelievable. Let's try one more time. Hopefully they won't disappoint us. Another fire truck arrived again, but... Looks like we got some false info, boys. Unfortunately, they still didn't notice the fire in front of them. It seems like the fire department in GTA 4 isn't helpful at all. In this video, the paramedic was the quickest to assist us, while the fire department didn't help at all. That's how the 911 logic works in GTA 4. Thank you for watching. See you in the next video.